What's up, man? Um, there's a rest in peace to the brother Sam Dubos or Sam Dubois, whatever the brother name is. Um, supposedly, the brother was drinking and driving. Police pulled him over. Uh, he handed him a can of liquor or, or beer or, or a cup or something. And refused to get out of the car. Supposedly, we, I'm telling you the police account. And, uh, he somehow was dragging the cop. He tried to drive off, drag the cop. Supposedly. Now, this is what the beast says. The same beast who told us that slavery ended, even though if you actually fucking read the goddamn 13th Amendment, there's a but in that motherfucking sentence. Um, same person who's been killing us 500 years. This is his side of the story. Uh, they will not release the tape. Okay, this this is the trick. They they trying to trick us. They trying to jump the race war off. This is how they trying to do it. They saying they so they go in one part of the story. They saying the tape is finna be released, but they saying they not gonna release the t the prosecutor. Not gonna release the tape without a court order because it might start riots. So what they doing? They conditioning black people to say, "Okay, we finna riot. This is bad. This is gonna be really fucking bad." Now it's not like we ain't been looking at police kill people on tape for the last five fucking years all over fucking YouTube. You can still look at people being killed or, or a live leak. All these black people being killed. Um. You can go on World Star Hip Hop and see motherfuckers get chopped up with fucking machetes. So, uh, beware of. My daddy told me something. I got fucked over by somebody one time, and my daddy told me, "Be careful about doing what people want you to do. Don't fall for the chess move. Don't. They trying to bait you into. Be like, oh, we finna ride. We finna tear some shit up because the." Video is so fucking bad. Who who says the video is so fucking bad? How do how do we know that it's so fucking bad? Um, but you know what I'm saying. Um, I'm gonna try to include the link in the description box. But if I don't, just go on Twitter, create you a fake ass Twitter account. You ain't gotta put your name up there and all that shit. That, that's your best way to get information. Uh, you know what I'm saying. Get you a Twitter account. But rest in peace to the family. It's supposed to be up in Cincinnati. A lot of people don't know. Cincinnati, I think they had riots up there in the early 2000, maybe 2001, 2003. I wasn't in the, in the country. But Cincinnati and the state of Ohio has been going through it throughout the 2000s. whole bunch of police killings. Uh, but the news don't mention all that shit. Cincinnati, Cleveland, uh, all them little towns up there. They've been fucking going through it. If you look at the history of Ohio, it was a uh, it, it was a real it was actually kind of like a Wild West type of state. Whole bunch of Indian wars and and, and slavery going on up there. You know what I'm saying? Slavery was in the north and the south. But anyway, um, them them some real G's up there. Respect. I got respect for y'all up there. Rest in peace to the family. Uh, if I get some updates, then I will try to update y'all. Uh, but I'm pretty busy in my life. I should slow down September, and I'll be able to give y'all better info. I wish y'all the best. Pray for peace, but definitely prepare for war. Prepare for fucking war. It's going to jump off sooner or later. Everybody, pick your motherfucking side. It's about to go down.